the moment I open it, but for some reason it's still playing here on the top right, which is quite good. Hello everyone and welcome to AI Plus More. And in this video, I'll be showing you how you can block ads on Twitch TV. So, there are... Oh yeah, I mean, I think it happens all the time. Whenever you want to watch another stream, like for example, Sea Dog VA stream here, there's always an ad that pops up at, the, at least most of the time in the beginning or in the middle of the stream. So here we are currently on Sea Dog VA stream, and fortunately this time we haven't seen an ad. But we can't be so lucky every time. So if we try and switch over to other streams, then there's a high possibility that we're gonna be encountering some ads. Like for example, this one by Sadistic Muffin. And there you go. There's an ad the moment I open it, but for some reason it's still playing here on the top right, which is quite good. Okay, so how do you actually remove this? Well, here's the thing. This can not work on Opera GX, which I'm using today. And that's why I'm gonna close this and I'm gonna head over to Google Chrome over here. I have Google Chrome here. So I don't have an ad blocker as of now because I'm gonna be showing you the entire process on how you can do that. So for the entire tutorial, you're going to be needing to head over to the links in the description and open those links because we'll be needing that for this video. Okay. So what we're going to be using something called Tamper Monkey, and it is an extension found on Google Chrome extension website, like the Chrome Web Store over here. And right now I have it installed or it's been added into my browser. And if we check here on our extensions, we we should be able to find Tamper Monkey. So if you haven't, you need to put this. So I'm gonna remove this so I can show you how you can do it. So it's uninstalled. I'm just gonna add it back and it should just ask you to add an extension and you should be able to have it on your browser. So it's been added to Chrome. Now, before we can have it working, so right now it won't really work. If we go ahead to a stream, like for this one, sometimes or most of the time, there should be an ad that pops up. So not all the time, there will be an ad. But if it doesn't pop up in the beginning of the stream or like when you start watching a stream, it will pop up later on when you're it will pop out later on in the middle of your viewing experience so we don't want that so how do we remove that so we need to refer here to this github website where this is something called twitch ad solutions so this repo aims to provide multiple solutions for blocking ads and we need to scroll down until we find the scripts over here so we're just gonna be choosing one of these so the first one is that it actually lowers the resolution of the stream using ads, but it does not stop the stream. For the second one, it's the same for video swap new, but it attempts to get a clean stream faster, but it will be a bit more laggy. So for me, I think I would choose the video swap new. So we just go here and click the user script. And then what we need to do is click here on install. So you can see that this is Tamper Monkey. And what you just need to do now is just click on install and you should have it on your Tamper Monkey. Let's check our Tamper Monkey extension over here and then it says it's enabled and it says that there's no script that is running. If you head over to the dashboard of the Tamper Monkey, what happens is that it will show you that there is actually a script that's running right now and it's currently enabled and I can disable it by flicking the switch. And I'm just gonna enable it again. So what that happened? What happens now is that it will now block ads on your Twitch viewing experience, which will lower the resolution so that the video can continue without an ad. But that's a small sacrifice for something really great, and that's not missing out on what you need to see on Twitch. So if we go back on Twitch again, we should not be able to encounter any more ads, but it will lower the resolution. If we notice that the resolution has been lowered, then that means it is working. So let's check out and find if we have it working. It says here blocking mid-roll ads. And you can see that the resolution is lower because it is working right now. And once it's gone, the resolution of the video should return back to its normal high quality, high definition version. So let's wait for the ad to go away. Right now it's currently...
there it is. Once the ad is gone, that was one long ad. You can see that it is back now. Even the text is no longer blurred. I mean, it's no longer pixelated and everything looks good. It's really now one in 1080 pixels and 60 FPS. And that is it. That is how you can enable ad blocking extension on your Twitch viewing experience so that you'll never have to go through ads again, although you have to go through lower resolutions for the time being. And actually, it's worth it. That's it. I hope this video helped you, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Hello guys, once again, this is Kim, and I would like to thank you all for watching this video. But don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get more free tutorials for your everyday needs. And come on, once again, let me tell you, it's free, okay? So if you change your mind, you can always unsubscribe later on, but I would suggest not to do that. Please, 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 please.